here they are. Striated caracaras doing what they do best, scavenging. This is exactly the type of scene a National Geographic crew expected to catch on camera when they went to the frigid Falkland Islands. What they didn't expect, well, the birds are better known by another name, Johnny Rooks, which is one of those old time phrases for thieves, pillagers, and mischief makers. These birds are also good at destroying things, like, well, campsites, for instance. Besides simple vandalism, stealing food is a specialty. And once the rumor gets out that a free meal is available, the Johnny Rooks have themselves a feast. This thievery isn't for personal enrichment. This is havoc for the heck of it. And for that purpose, it doesn't get any better than messing with toilet paper. So why was the crew here in the first place? To capture Johnny Rooks as they reveal their very own generation gap. Actually, more like a chasm. An adult Johnny Rook wades into a bunch of adolescents to take control of a rockhopper penguin carcass and teach these young punks a thing or two about who's in charge here. This adult looks like he's gonna kick some tail feathers, and he does a thorough, convincing job of it. After this thrashing, the adult discovers the young Johnny Rooks still don't appear to realize who rules this roost. Okay. His mate joins the fray. Together, they show they mean business. This is a mean, nasty, take no prisoners battle. The adults win and celebrate with a raucous victory whoop. And then enjoy the spoils of victory. The young Johnny Rooks get a one way ticket to Palookaville. This is a harsh, desolate island, and finding food here is no easy task. They scour the coastline for anything edible. One thing is certain, a penguin dinner with the folks is not in their future. <laughs> 